Hello, in this video I would like to show you the remote control module and how to program it. The first thing that we need to do, we need to pair our remote with the receiver. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take two control wires, configuration wires, it's uh, white and green and short them, and uh, I'm going to supply the power. And after five uh, seconds, uh, the light will turn on for just one second, telling us it's in a pairing mode. So now I can pr uh, push the remote button, uh, for example, A, to pair the button A. Uh, the light comes on for one second, so it stores the proper code for this remote button A, and it's now paired with uh, button A. If you want, you can uh, pair button B as well. You can pair up to uh, five remotes with the same receiver. And I'm going to dis uh, disconnect the power. So this is default mode where the pushing of the button will just turn on the power and will stay on until you push the button one more time. So you're pushing the button, it turns on, push the button, it turns off. So A and B is working and if I will push uh, D, it's not gonna work and so is C. Only A and B because we sync them up, uh, we paired those buttons only. Now you can also use this module to supply uh, impulse or not latching uh, signal and it could be from really short like 0.1 second to trigger something to a very long half an hour uh, signal so you can even use it to power up uh, some devices for a period of time by just pushing the button so way i'm gonna do that i'm gonna short two configuration wires and this is all in the manual but just i'm gonna show it to you how it's done here so i'm gonna power the module and disconnect two wires i'm not gonna wait until the light comes on after five seconds because this is pairs the remote and we already done so so now i'm gonna uh, first of all hold two wires for a period of time let's say i need five seconds and disconnect it and i'm gonna confirm it just by shorting two wires and uh, that's it so i'm gonna now supply the power and by pushing the remote, I'm going to activate the that uh, non-latching signal, and it stays there for five seconds. Now you can also turn it off. So if you if it's a very long, but let's say if it's ten minutes, uh, you can turn and you can push a button to turn it off. Push it on and turn it off. Now you can go back. So this will be a non-latching mode. To go back to the latching mode, you have to re uh, reprogram the receiver and uh, I'm gonna push two white wires connect the power disconnect it and I'm gonna just uh, connect it uh, once and disconnect and uh, here we go it's in non-latching mode that is it thank you